Hey guys, welcome back to Open With Arlo and today we have the Tawny Mini Brands. So in our last video, or the video before that actually, we did the normal Mini Brands and today we have managed to get the Toy Mini Brands. So we've got three of these capsules and then we also have the collector's case which has the four exclusive minis inside. So we actually have somewhere proper to keep hold of everything. Uh, so we're gonna open that and we're gonna see what we get. So first we're gonna open this. Now I think these ones are actually really cool because you get the different uh, toys in them instead of just like the, the food brands. As you can see on the front, you're gonna all sorts of different things. Crayola, the water balloons, even SpongeBob. So I'm excited to see what we're gonna get. And um, open this one. So inside, you can see we get like a little picture thing of all the different things you can get, which looks really cool. And I think if we take this off, and um, you can already see. Two of the ones that we've got. So we have got here a let's get that out. A slip and slide. Which is, I always wanted one of these as a kid, but was never allowed them. We always had to make our own. So uh, there's number one. And then the JoJo bow. This one is so cool. Little sparkly Jojo bow on the back. You can see her there. It's like, you even read some of the stuff on the back. That's how cool the mini brands are that they're like so realistic. And then on this side, we have got what is this? Looks like glue, washable glue by Crayola which is pretty cool. And then our last one, down at the bottom, looks like some sort of SpongeBob figure thing. It's a SpongeBob robot, which I'm guessing in real life, you'd be able to piece together. That looks really cool. And then obviously we just have the normal case where we'd be able to store some bar things in so that is the collector's case and here are the four things that we got so we've got the slip and slide the jojo bow the glue and spongebob see them there so now we'll open the little capsules Okay, so now we're going to open the capsules. So here's our first one. We'll just peel off the plastic. Again, rubbish at opening these. And then I remember from last time that there is actually another layer of plastic that you have to open. Where is it? There it is. So same with just the normal mini brands, we get five different ones in the capsules. So we'll take this off and then we'll open it up and we'll start with the biggest one first. So we get our first checklist which will be very good and so you can use these to check which ones you've got and also to check if you've got rare ones or common ones our first one out the capsules is a little robot see there guys and it actually has the robot inside I think should see if we can open it up take the Celtic puff can actually open this up and get the little robot out that's so cool so here we go 
Now, I think I'm just going to keep it inside the packaging, but you can take it out and store it however you want, but that is very cool. So we will just pop all that back in there. And there we go. Oh, popped off. So our first one from that capsule is the robot. Pop that over there. Second one. Ooh, now what is this going to be? We will get all the pieces out. Some stickers. And it looks like we have some shelves. Just some shelves, just keep some stuff on. So I will build that and I'll be right back. Okay, so here we go guys, here's a little shelf. We have like the little barcode stickers to tell you what they are, which is really cool. So if we just put that over there. Oh, it's even got wheels on the bottom as well. So you can like, you can't actually, but you know, metaphorically wheel it around. And we can just stick our robot on there like that. It's pretty cool. Okay, so the next one, number three. We have got some, it's like an untamed dragon. See from this side. Can you see it? There we go. Looks like it kind of attaches onto something. Again, I'm assuming that if you were to open up the packaging, you could get them out. This one is freezer. Oh, it's kind of like, like a fingerling thing. Oh, it's pretty cool. So we shall pop that over there. Like that. And go on to number four. Oh, I've seen these. So we actually have a miniature version of the mini brands ball. And there's nothing inside of it. I thought there might be something inside of it. So there's that one. Like a complete replica of it. Ooh, dropped it. Complete replica, but that is really cool. So obviously if it was a toy shop, they'd sell mini brands. So we will just put that one over there. Will it stay? And the last one for this capsule, we have a hula hoop. Miniature hula hoop, of course. See that there? Oh, the packaging is upside down. Just a little hula hoop. But there's a little hula hoop. And we will actually, let's use the checklist that we've got and see if anything that we've got is a rare. So obviously we didn't get any of, or we haven't yet got any of the gold ones. And we haven't got any of the uh, glow in the dark ones. But if you look there, we actually managed to get Oh, we've got two. So we've got the Rare Metallic Mini Brands Ball and the Rare Metallic Jojo Bow. That is really cool. And then the common ones there. So our glue is a common one. And then if we turn it over, our dragon kind of uh, fingerling thing is a common one. And our robot, she's just there. Is also a common one and then if you can see here these are all the different shelving things you can get so we just got the normal shelves but you can also get the trolley the basket and the bags so so far we actually have two metallic rare ones which is pretty cool so let's go on to that all those ones done yep let's go on to the next capsule now see if we can get any rare ones in this one if I can open it there we go again I always struggle to open these and then don't forget the second layer of plastic and then we'll take off the rubber on top let's see what we get from this one so let's 
starting with the biggest one, like always. Ooh, I see another part of the storage collection. I think we've got the basket. Let me just double check. We did. So now this time we have the basket to add to our shelves. So give me two seconds and I'll be right back with that. Okay, so here we have the little basket, which I think is just so cool. Again, has wheels on, but I think these ones work a little bit better. And then we have the toy mini brands. Oh, there's a hair. The toy mini brands on the side, which I think is really cool. So we will add that to the little shelving collection which is also really cool and we will move on to the next one so number two ah oh, we have another jojo bow which i think this just might be the normal jojo bow but that is also very cool so put that with the basket and then we'll go with this one next throw it a little bit open Oh, now I've seen these and I really, really wanted one because I love the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And here we have Leonardo. Leonardo's not my favourite. Um, sorry, Donatello, the purple one is my favourite one, but that's still really cool. Another little minifigure. We'll put that over there. So, number four. Tricky swooping. We have got look at this blaze and the monster machines the blaze speedway car ready to roll this is really cool shame that nothing actually comes inside of it because actually having the car would have been cool but nonetheless really cool packaging very very realistic and then our last one for this capsule will be we got another checklist always helpful and we have got a little snake so here we have a robo alive snake which also i'm assuming if you were to open up the packaging you'll be able to get it out i'm not going to get it out but there we go robo alive snake so from the second capsule we got the leonardo we got the Jojo bow. We got our very cool shopping cart. We got the blazing the monster trucks or monster machines, whichever it's called. And we got the little snake. So moving on to our third and final ball. We'll check at the end to see if any of uh, those ones are rare or not. We'll just get this one opened up first. Hope we get another rare or even a glow in the dark rare, that would be cool. And then, where are you? There, I'm on this side. Nope, this side. There we go. Again, always struggle with the plastic because never make anything easy. Take off the seal, put that over there, and then our for third and final capsule number one. Oh, we what looks like guys we have the shopping cart so we are so close to finishing off the storage section all we would need would be the little plastic bags which would be so cool so here are the instructions for that one And two seconds and I'll be right back with you. Okay guys, so here's a little shopping cart. It's very fiddly. So if you're opening this by yourself, you might want to ask someone for help because I can't do it. But very cool. Comes with a little flag in it. The little bat bit wouldn't stay on. But very, very cool. So we'll just put that there. The flag already fallen down. Which is fine. We shall just move on. So number two, the next bit another checklist and what looks like some sort of gun oh we have got 
the X Shot Reflex 6. Very cool. Kind of like a Nerf gun. Very, very cool. Have a look on the back there. Ultra realistic. Super, super realistic. We'll put that there. Number three. We'll go with this one. We have got Crayola. Let focus. Crayola watercolors. Also very cool. Just a nice little simple watercolor thing, which does match. Over here, our Crayola Crayola glue. Very cool. We'll pop that there. Oh, fell over. So our second to last one of the video. We've got ooh, an all sport frisbee in blue. Very cool. Again, if you was probably you can see there, if you was to open the packet, it's a real frisbee. Just a miniature version. We'll put that over there. And our last one, this video, is we have got a oh, a shimmer shine genie. So this is shine, this one. On the back there you see the two different ones you can get. So we obviously have shine, which is this one. But again, very cool for this capsule. The very last capsule, we got the X shot, we got the watercolors, the basket, which I will figure out and I will get it to go properly. We got the Shimmer and Shine Genie and we got the Frisbee. So let's have a look and see if we got any rares or not. So I don't think we got any rares. We just got the normal extra we didn't get the gold one and we just got the normal frisbee we didn't get the glow in the dark one so let's try and find our common ones so dun, dun, dun. so this one this jojo bow actually says it's a collector's case exclusive but we did not get it in a collector's case so that's very cool um there's our spongebob right from the beginning that is also a collector's case exclusive and there's our slip and slide uh there's our hula hoop um where else have we got da -da -da -da. there's our our blaze there's our shine from shimmer and shine our leonardo and then obviously we got the shop and trolley and the basket all very cool things so that was today's video opening the collector's case and then opening three capsules really hope you enjoyed guys and join us for the next one